at noon, a South Florida wig warehouse is ripped off and police are searching for the thief. The owner says he got an alert on his phone when somebody broke in. Police say more than $80,000 worth of wigs are gone. CBS 4's Peter Dent is live in Miami Gardens with this story. Peter. Well, Carly, we can tell you that the owner of this business says this was not a random burglary. He says the thieves knew exactly what they were doing when they broke in around 2.30 this morning. They knew precisely what specialty wigs they were looking for. And they even know a lot about the stock room of this business. Oh, it's a big loss for me. It's a big loss for me. Rakib Hossein is stunned by the damage done by the thieves who ransacked his prime trading international company, stealing, he says, at least $80,000 worth of high-end wigs from inside this warehouse. Some products is very exclusive. It's hard to find for me from India. And the longer length wigs, those are very exclusive, 15, inch, 16 inch wigs. And these, they know what they're like. They took everything. He says surveillance tape shows a truck backing into the front door and ramming it at least three times. They, they try to blast like uh, two times, they try to smash. Hossein believes up to four criminals were here for no more than five minutes. They knew everything. They knew everything. What are the, where are the expensive things? They knew my stock rooms and everything. The crime is similar to a break-in at this wigs and hair business two weeks ago at 47th Avenue and Northwest 165th Street, in which the owner says up to $100,000 worth of wigs and other items were taken. It is right across from Hossein's business. My reaction to yeah. this, uh, it's happened before, and there's somebody out there that knows where, you know, where the money's at, and that's, they're going after the uh, hair places. And I hope, you know, these people get caught because, you know, this is our livelihood here. here. You know, this is our job. What would you like to say to the public if they know anything about whoever did this? Yeah, please uh, help us to find the robber so I can get my merchandise back. Now back here live and speaking of just that, take a look at this brand new surveillance tape we obtained from a business right across from Hossein's company. It shows a U-Haul truck ramming the front door repeatedly at least two or three times, as we mentioned, in order for them to get in around 2.30 this morning. After the ramming by the U-Haul truck, the thieves went inside. It's not known if these same thieves broke into that business we referred to two weeks ago. Now, Hussein, who is insured for his losses, here after the ramming by that U-Haul truck says this has never happened to him before. If you can help Miami Gardens Police with this case, call them or Miami Day Crime Stoppers at 305-471-TIPS. We're live in Miami Gardens. Peter Danch, CBS 4 News. Carly, back to you. Peter, thank you.